Good morning, Eagles. It's Jackson. Um, today is Tuesday, September 26, and here are the morning announcements for this week. My name's Colin. Our football game with Good Pasture this week is one of the four nominations for the Fireball Fridays Game of the Week, presented by Whataburger. Voting closes at 11 p.m. on Wednesday evening, September 27th, which is tomorrow night. The winning game will be announced on Thursday, September 28th via the Titans social media channels. Go to www.tennesseetitans.com slash community slash fireball dash Fridays to vote. Hello, my name is Shabriel. Students, remember to use your EF planner. Now's the time to complete your August reflections and September intentions, as well as map out the monthly calendar view. 30% of the students, 13 to 17 years old, have required medical intervention for anxiety in the past year. We know that students who routinely use the EF planner system will experience an intermediate reduction in anxiety. Hi, I'm Paxton. Our annual career fair is Thursday, November 2nd, and we would love any parent, grandparent, or family member is any career field to, par to participate. Check the weekly email for, for the link to register to be part of this this or contact Janet King or King J at nationalchristian.org or Sandra Shelton at Shelton S at nationalchristian.org for more information. The homecoming pictures by Tucker Photography are now available. Check the weekly email for the link to view and purchase your pictures. The Mexico Mission Service Club is, is hosting a used book drop. They are collecting used books to trade for Spanish children's books, which Miss Gupton and Miss Arnold will take to the city of children in October. They are also able to, t to take complete good quality memory games and puzzles with 100% pieces or less. Bring any items for this pri to this drive to this lower school front office by this Friday, September 29th. Contact Miss Arnold or Miss Gupton if you have any questions. Hello students, my name is Rebecca. This is a reminder for any student who's planning on participating in a school sport this year. Please remember to have your high school athletes sports physical performed for this upcoming athletic calendar year. A new physical is needed each school year. Please register at nationalchristiantn.finalforms.com and follow the prompts to upload the signed documents. If you have questions, please contact Holly Haynes at HaynesH at NashvilleChristian.org. Hello, my name is Michael, and here are this week's sports. Today, high school cross country has a meet at Innsworth. The girls run at 415 and the boys at 445. Also, high school girls soccer plays, ho plays host to Good Pasture for a for a game here at NCS starting at 5 p.m. On Thursday, high school girls soccer traveled to Fairby for a game that starts at 6 p.m. And then on Friday, high school football heads to Good Pasture. Kickoff is at 7 p.m. I'm here with Bic. And the question is, if you were stranded on a desert island, what three items would you have? A Bible a lot of water, and a lot of food. All right, I am here with... Raylan. Poppy. And the question for the day is, if you were stranded on a desert island, what three items would you have? Food, water, and my phone. Phone, water, and phone again. All right. I am here with... Ashley. Amelia. And today's question is, if you were stranded on a desert island, what three items would you have? Probably water, food, and my friend. Um, probably water, a Bible, maybe like a volleyball to keep me busy. All right. I'm here with Robbie. And the question is, if you were stranded on a desert island, what three items would you have? My phone, a portable charger, and water. Okay. I am here with Mr. Polk's Bible class, and today's question is, if you were stranded on a desert island, what three items would you have? Um, I'd probably bring, like, a sleeping bag, the Bible, and a box of Coca-Cola. Um, a journal, non-perishables, and matches. 
uh, a bed, my cat, and a record player. <laughs> okay. Um, a fire starter, a knife, and some granola bars. Oh, I'll have to say, uh, Bear Grylls, survival guide, and a uh, fire starter. I'm here with Ashley. And the question is, if you were stranded on a desert island, what three items would you have? My phone, a friend, and my dog. Okay. Hello, this is Nate. The Bible verse is Matthew 5, 6. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they will be filled. Please bow for the prayer. Dear God, thank you for this day. Thank you for everything you've given us. Please help the people in the hospital. Please help everyone through school to, and hope they have a great day. And please help the staff in your name, amen. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thanks for watching.